Hello there, welcome back. You're watching the Light here on Press TV. Ron has welcomed a group of foreign tourists on board a private European train as part of its new policy to promote tourism. It's the first time such a train has been allowed to enter the country. More in this report. Rolling into northwestern Iran, this luxury train is making a stop at Zanjan station carrying more than 60 European passengers. The train has come to the country as part of a two-week tour organized by a British travel agency. The Golden Eagle Danube Express is the first ever European private train to be permitted to enter the Iranian territory. The train brings new opportunities for the country's tourism industry, which experts say could host around 5 million visitors by the end of the year. As this year, the number of foreign tourists has risen to about 3 million. This is why we still have a high season ahead and predict that this number will surpass 5 million tourists. Last year we had 2 million and 300,000 travelers and it has already doubled according to our data and should at least reach 4 million and 600,000 this year. But I think it will even go beyond this. The train began its two-week journey in mid-October from Hungary and has now arrived in Iran after passing through Romania. Bulgaria and Turkey. This tourist is really excited about her trip to Iran. What I came for is this, the UNESCO heritage sites, the, the wonderful cultural history, and also the people. Apart from Zanjan, the Golden Eagle train will stop in the ancient cities of Yaz, Shiraz, Esfahan, and finally the capital Tehran. Once in Tehran, some passengers will fly back to their home countries, while the further 65 passengers will join the return tour.